finally back. You're done finally questioning the innkeeper. You were there for quite a while. Of course I got the key. It was easy. The old buffoon kept it right in his back pocket. What? No, I'm just... I'm just tired. I... Just tired is all. Maybe we can head back to our room? No, nothing's wrong. I'm a goblin, remember? Tiny legs, we've been walking a lot today. Really, I'm fine. But, um, you were in the room a while with the innkeeper. What did she have to say? So, she didn't have the information we needed, but she knows who has it. Well, for not knowing anything, you were in there quite a while. No, nothing. I'm just concerned for you, because she seemed really interested in you. She was annoying because she kept on making small talk. I don't know. I was just curious. Hey, I was... I was looking at that. I told you nothing's wrong. I just like looking at keys. I like shiny things. I'm just tired, that's all. I'm not a terrible liar. I'm a very good liar, thank you very much. Working at a tavern before, you had to learn how to lie your way around things. <sighs> it's just... I don't know. She seemed to really like you. She's really pretty, too. Oh, I know you... I mean, I know that you like me and all, but we didn't really say it was like official or anything. Well, well I mean, I guess it was kind of apparent that we were together, but I don't know, she's a really pretty tall lady and she likes you and beautiful and I know you think I'm beautiful but I'm just this tiny little stubby goblin and you're in the forever with her I guess I just figured that I mean I know you said you liked me, but at least I just figured it was only a matter of time that they would all go away. Why would I think that? Because that's what always happens. I'm always overlooked. It's just how it is. When someone bigger and nice and someone just overall better comes along. 
I'm, they're usually dropped. I'm just kind of used to it by now. Sorry, I don't really think I can look up at you right now. I'm just really embarrassed and I feel like I'm going to cry any second. No, don't come down here. <sighs> really? You really mean that? I'm sorry. Just kind of gets in my head that. I don't know. Someone like you really wouldn't like someone like me. <laughs> Alright. Of course I do. Here you were just questioning an innkeeper and I was going a mile a minute a few feet away outside. It was, believe me, it was really easy stealing those keys. I barely didn't even notice I was there. So after I got them, I sat down and I just waited and I guess your mind can tell you things that aren't true. I guess so. So many people really didn't like me or they just kind of dismissed me. I figure that's all that will ever happen now. I'm happy it doesn't happen with you. I guess I just decided to just get it over with. So I wouldn't be surprised. You don't know how happy that makes me. <laughs> but, um, so, on a happier note, does that mean that, I mean, I know it doesn't really need to be said, I guess, but, so, is this little goblin your girlfriend now? You've never really said it. I guess I haven't either. <laughs> of course I am. Well, I'm very happy that I am. <laughs> I don't think I've actually ever really been anyone's girlfriend before. <laughs> nope. Well, I mean, I thought I was once, but I really wasn't. Kind of been always a hit and miss, mainly miss. <laughs> kind of gotten used to it by now, which is kind of why all this happened. <laughs> Their last, eh? Well, I'm certainly happy that they lost. Because I only really want you. <laughs> and I only really want you. And I'm really never letting go. 
No, I'm too happy. I guess I'm just happy to know that what I thought before isn't true. So, I'm just... I just really want to be in your arms right now. And nowhere else. <laughs> you know, I know I always joke about how I'm a little stubby goblin, but one thing about being a nice little stubby goblin is that being held feels really nice, because I'm so tiny. I like being held in your arms. I truly feel safe there. Also, um, I think this would be a good time to tell you that I may may not have pocketed a few coins from the innkeeper card. You know, the one where I got the key from? Well, it was sort of his own fault. He rushed past me, practically knocked me over, and then he gave me that look. You know, that get out of the way, you stupid little goblin look. So I figured if he lost a few gold coin, it really wouldn't matter. And before I was going down my downward spiral, I sort of ordered a lot of room service. I've been really craving milk. You know I like milk. And we've been on the road for quite a while and it's, but he hasn't come up. Hey, milk before bed. If you want to order anything, I do have a bit of spare change. <laughs> Indeed, I'm your sneaky little goblin. If you ever need anything, Super easy to take things. <laughs> but until that lovely room service comes, I'm happy to stay right here. Where I know I'm wanted. And where I belong. I hope you know that. I really treasure you too. I really do. <laughs>